Hey guys, on today's video I'm going to teach you how to close Windows properly on Mac. So to get started I have this right here which is Google Chrome and I can see that on the top left hand side it's Chrome. So to properly close this I can just click on Chrome and then it's going to say quit Chrome. That's actually going to close Chrome because if I have my Chrome window right here and if I click right here on the red, you might think it's closed, but it's actually running in the background. Now, how do I know that? Well, down here below, I can see that there's that dot underneath it. That means it's open because that's those dots underneath each program are only the programs that are open right now. Plus, if I go into my Apple logo on the top left hand side, force quit, I'm going to see all the applications that are running at the moment. So that's how I know Google Chrome, it's still open. So let me just close this up for now. So once again, in order to properly close Google Chrome or any app for that matter on your Mac, just go into the last option where it says quit Google Chrome. Um, this could be Safari, this could be Photoshop, Illustrator, any application on your Mac. So if I do that, and if I go to my Apple logo, force quit, as you will see, Google Chrome isn't here anymore. Now let me just open up Google Chrome once again. And the quick way that I like to do this is pressing Command Q. So if I press Command Q, there we go. It's closed. And that's properly closed, so it's not working in your background. By having all these windows, you know, not really closed, then your Mac's gonna run slower. So in order to make it go faster and run everything properly, it's good to fully close each application, unless you're gonna use it later on, then maybe just minimize it like that. Because at the end of the day, whether you're pressing this or this, which is actually to minimize, it's kind of the same thing. Anyways, this is the exact same thing whether you guys have a MacBook, iMac, MacBook Pro, Mac Mini, it doesn't matter. This is the proper way to close any app on your Mac. Anyways, if you guys have any questions, comments, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.